Hello everybody, welcome to Vickyville. I wanted to share a video with you all about my October planner setup. And I wanted to share with you just some of the products that I use because I love Halloween and I know so many of you do too. And so I wanted to go ahead and share that with you. So let's get started. Okay, first off, there's gonna be a lot of stuff here. <laughs> and I just can't wait to show you because it's so fun to, to do. So these were a few of the ribbons that I um, started off with. And so as you can see, I love the bright and bold colors for Halloween. I know there's, last year I kind of tried to do pastelloween for my planner. And so this year I wanted to go with the traditional uh, colors and I really had fun doing that. So that was a lot of fun. So I'll put those there. Then I used some washi tape and this is the washi from Pebbles. And I love it because it has like the pumpkin and the ghost and it says happy Halloween and it's just fun. And you always need some good Halloween washi. So that was adorable okay then i just got this spider webbing from probably dollar tree i've had it in my stash for since last year i believe and it has like the little spiders in it and i'll show you how i use that you say you use that in your planner and yes i did <laughs> okay then what else um okay this was really fun i showed this on my instagram if you saw uh it's and if you want to follow me on Instagram, I'm at Vicky, no, Vickyville underscore. And I, I share a lot of stories, a lot of personal things, um, but a lot of fashion. And uh, I showed in my story that we had a, an amazing, it's tangled, so I'm gonna untangle it while I tell you the story. We have an amazing um, Scrapbook Expo vendor who makes fabulous jewelry and she's been on the show floor for so many years and I've never gotten to her booth because it's always too packed and I don't have you know I never had time but while we were having one of our shop at home events um, virtually she had all of these Halloween kits and I love Halloween and I love vintage and so when I saw that she was selling at a great deal, I believe you got like all kinds of pieces of jewelry, the the necklace, the the glass um, cover, the images, and you got a lot for, I believe it was like $29. I'm not sure if she still has that kit, but at our event, you got 20% off using the coupon code. So I bought myself um, this Halloween kit for the jewelry making and I added it to my planner. I've been making my niece and I Paisley She made some necklaces for her mom and for herself and I made a necklace for myself But I also made some planner charms for my planner. So I'm going to show you that now, but if you're interested um, Go look at craft fantastic and she has so many things. I'm sure Christmas is coming up, but I love Halloween So that was a really good deal Okay, this is the paper line that I decided to use, which is um, from Doodlebug, and it's called Candy Carnival. And I'll go ahead and flip through that fast. Look at how cute. I love these cut-aparts because I've already used one in my planner just for a list of things, so that's so cute. You can see I used this piece of paper already. Uh, that's just the little kiddos, and then these are like little ticket tickets and then there's the whole carnival paper on the back i love it here's some more cut out cut apart and i just love this to like you know work in your scrapbook or your planner i'm also using it in my december day or october daily so so cute that's a replica let's see what else i love this to add for like borders so cute and then that's the back side, just the pumpkin. Here's some carnival candy and apple and cotton candy. And then just the pretty polka dot pink on the back. This is, oh, this reminds me of what is the, the house, the carnival where you go in and the mirrors are all. <laughs> and then just the stripe on the back. 
And then I believe these are, here's one more cut apart. And I love, like I said, I love these and I use these. You could just um, cut them apart and then hole pump them and they can be used. And I'll show you how I did that. So this is the paper line that I use and I think it's so cute. I love doodle bug. So that is fun and fabulous. Okay, then I also got their uh, ephemera pack and it was $7.99 and it comes with so many cute pieces if you could see that. And this vendor I use was Craft and Creative. Yeah, cra no, Craft and Creativity. And um, they also are a vendor at our shop at home. <coughs> so uh, we always have special coupon codes and I believe that you got 25% off of all of this. So. Um, just watch on Saturdays. We have uh, shopping at home and there's all kinds of great deals going on so that you can't beat it. I, uh, I love Doodlebug and Craft and Creativity has a great selection of Doodlebug. That's where I get it all from now and I love their website. So check it out. Okay, so that's the ephemera. And now let me show you my planner so cute i hope you can get it all in there but this is my baby um it's a filofax planner and it's in this beautiful purple that is so reminds me of halloween i love it this deep purple and okay so here is the i always like to make kind of like a little belt <laughs> and this is uh, the belt that I used here. I just had this piece of lace, black lace. I don't know if you could see that with the lighting, but, and I backed it with just some felt so that it could stay around the, you know, the elastic. And then I added this big um, orange ribbon, just a little Dollar Tree spider. And here's what I was talking about with the Craft Fantastic jewelry. I made a little charm. So I don't know if you can see that, but look at how cute that is. It's a little L and a little, yeah, they're both L's. <laughs> so how cute is that? And that's so cute. And that just hangs right off of the charm. Okay, down here, I made a hanging charm and I did the same thing. Just added all those ribbons and added this fun bow. And then here is, uh, this was a keychain, and I just added three of the little jewelry pieces to it. So there's like two little witches. Can you see that? I don't know if you, there we go. Two little witches, and then here is a most adorable vintage kitty. And then on the last one is a little pumpkin. And he is so cute, I don't know, there we go. It's hard to film these. <laughs> and this is just all the fun ribbon that I had in my stash and I just made like a little planner keychain to go. Okay, so now, can you see that? We're gonna open her up. So she just goes like that. And then here is my planner setup. And like I was saying, this is where I use the spider web. So this is my whole doodle bug line. And then the spider web I just put behind here with a little um, silver foiled spider and then another Dollar Tree spider. And I just use one of those cut, up, cut out, cut aparts from the doodle bug collection. And so that was super cute, I love it. Here's just the ephemera from that uh, doodle bug um, carnival collection just added a little twine bow black and white added some little i don't know if you could see that but just little enamel dots there from the keep it simple line i love we have seven different colors they're so cute and i just added some of my planner clips that i had in my stash and then here's the cut apart, like I was saying, you could use it and hole punch 
and it becomes it becomes you could open it up like that and how cute is that but I wanted to show you this clip right here that says happy Halloween with a little bow there and that I got that from Etsy um, I believe what shop is that that I got those clips from um, I can't remember but I will say in my next video where it's at and then I will try to link it below and then these were just more this I got from um, one of our awesome guests that when we went uh, for scrapbook expo and we had a little planner um, swap and she gave me that with the wandering planners in a little goodie bag for me so that was so nice of her she's so I love let me show you how chunky the tooling is it's a tooling but look at how cute and it's just so chunky look at all that tooling she's just so beautiful and this is like one of my favorite planner clips that I've ever ever received okay and then here's the doodle bug paper in the background, which is so festive. Just added the same. I love to add like ribbon, you know, um, border on the on the edge of it. So that's what I did there. Okay. Then you turn the page, and this is just some of those cut aparts that I use there to, you know, to decorate the back of that page. And then I made a little sh a little shaker. If you could see that like a little shaker insert just added another bow so I love bows and I hot glued these little little guy and this little pumpkin and I just also added in the shaker some um, beautiful white flakes to give it more of you know just illumination it looks so cute I love it this is where I use that crepe paper um, washi up here if you can see the pumpkin and I just think that's so fun. And then you turn the page and then here is some of my um, my actual planning. That's so cute. And then I just added this pen here that I just uh, hot glued a little witch's hat to. And then, like I said, you could use all kinds of cut aparts. What I've done, I love just adding different pieces that are fun and I have all my pages all ready to go with lists. I love making myself lists of things um, to work on that I have goals and um, Bible plans that I read, um, Bible devotional part uh, plans and stuff. And so this is my fun October Halloween setup. And I just, I love it. It's just so fun. It's the perfect colors for me because they're bright and they're so happy and I love Halloween and I'm just so excited. <laughs> and then here's the friend again. So if you get a chance to go on um, Craft Fantastic for this awesome, cute, cute jewelry making and then Craft and Creativity for all kinds of goodies and I think that's it. So thank you for watching. Oh, I wanted to share show with you. I'm also, when I'm bored and I'm just like watching Dancing with the Stars or I don't know, you know, whatever, Housewives. <laughs> Those are my guilty pleasures. I've been cutting with my silhouette. And how cute is this little chunky bear that I, it's actually just a little bear, but I made it Halloween. So she has like little bat cheeks and little Halloween colors and then it says pumpkin season so you you know whenever you're just wanting to create but you don't really want to you know scrapbook or make cards I like to just um, make little creations so when I'm ready to scrapbook I could just glue this right to my page and it would be ready to go so so much fun so thank you guys for watching and I will see you again with my next video. Remember, Vickyville loves you and keep it crafty. Bye!